Hey, what's going on? This is Nate. Welcome back. I still have a camera. This is my old camera. So if um, I'm out of focus, I apologize. Also, I, I just haven't been feeling well. I was going to try to make a video a couple weeks ago, but I just, I don't know, I've been tired. I did a magnesium bath like a month ago, and it made me really sleepy. Um, I would I actually slept through the night, which was cool, and then I would make breakfast, and I was taking like a post-breakfast nap, and I was just sleeping for like a week. So I figured that it was, I needed, you know, the magnesium. So I did another one, and I did it for a lot longer, and it just really cashed me. Um, I wasn't feeling very good before I started this. I think I just have overextended myself, because that's what I tend to do. But that really just kind of... Um, but that really sent me back. Uh, I'm just really dehydrated. My, I, I just turned really red and my skin's all dry and I'm just crampy everywhere. I'm trying to pound potassium, but it's just not working. And the heat usually bothers me, but it's been way worse since I did that. And I've basically just been laying around. I haven't really done anything for a long time, which is frustrating because I need to get seeds in the ground and I need to harvest what I have, but I'm just not in any place to do that outside right now. I'm really trying not to talk about my health too much because I just, I mean, I never really feel good. So I don't know, but my, my one friend was like, you should, you know, share more of that. But I feel like it's complaining. So I, I don't know. I don't, but then I just wanted to let everyone know why I haven't been posting videos. I'm going to try to get back to posting them. I don't know if they'll be as regularly posted just because I don't know if I have the energy to, to do two a week at this point, but I'm going to try to get back to posting. My goal right now is I'm just going to try to do like 20, 30 minutes of work a day just to do something because I have a lot to do. Um, in that month, my hot water heater broke. I thought it was a thermocouple and I was hoping it was a thermocouple because I have a couple extra thermocouples, but my buddy looked at it. He knows more than I do and he said it wasn't a thermocouple and to call a place, you know, because it's under warranty and if he worked on it, the warranty would be voided. Plus he just, you know, he, it's easier for him to get parts and all that. But anyway, I wanted to get rid of the propane water heater so I didn't have exposed pipes running underneath my house for winter because that way I won't have to run heat tape on it and use electricity all winter. Plus it's just a pain when they freeze, you know, the heat tape doesn't work all the time. They have to deal with it. So I was going to replumb my whole house. I was going to finish it and replumb everything in October. And when, I, you know, when I had energy, it'd probably take me a couple weeks, but now I'm it kind of worked out because I need to start right now because I'm just going to chip away at it. I need to have it done before winter because I don't want to work on it during winter. But anyway, that's what I'm going to do today. I'm stuck inside because it's pretty hot out. So I'm just going to start taking my kitchen apart. Um, I'm going to finish the whole house, but long story short, just to give you a quick little recap of what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the window out, frame it up, move the kitchen over. Where the kitchen's at, I'm gonna build a built-in little thing for the fridge and then shelves on top, and then finish everything floored up, and then build some built-in shelves where the fridge is now. Um, with the bottom being all a metal, metal like little wall thing so I can put my heater there and not have it in the middle of my house during winter. So I guess that's what I'm doing today. I'm also going to do the storage a little bit differently. Right now it's really hard for me to reach back. So what I'm going to do is kind of, I'm going to leave the middle stud because holding up my dryer and I'm going to take out the front one and I'm going to take up, take off that whole shelf up there and I'm going to cut it in half and just leave half of it. So I'll be able to access it through the middle, but I'll be able to access both ends um, on the large side. Probably doesn't really make much sense, but I don't know how to explain it any better than that.
that's all I'm gonna do today. I have some materials on order. I don't know when those are gonna get in, but at least now I'm ready when they do. I can move on. Um, can't really do anything else until the electrician comes. I'm gonna have him take the box out of the middle so I can move things around it. Um, I don't. I'm not gonna mess with, elect with electricity. I know I don't know enough about that to do it. So I'm gonna let someone else do it. The other stuff, you know, if I mess it up, I can just redo it. That stuff. Um, not a lot of second chances. But thanks for hanging out. Um, I appreciate it. Take it easy. Be good. Catch you later.